Guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel, Keith the Traveller. Uh, as I tend to put together a lot of travel vlogs, I'd also thought I'd put a little bit of a uh, guide to how to be a digital nomad and how you can actually uh, travel the world and work at the same time. Uh, and specifically this is about how to be a digital nomad uh, through affiliate marketing, online affiliate marketing. So if you want to know a bit more, then uh, carry on watching. So the first question, probably should ask yourself is actually what is an affiliate well I'm sure you've all bought travel insurance car insurance when you've looked for flights you see a comparison website the moment you click on that link and you buy your car insurance or travel insurance the site the comparison site has just made from you money from you that's because that's an affiliate essentially an affiliate is a middleman you send in traffic from your website to another website so that you can say make money from that a good example is I'm recording this on the GoPro right now you're interested in buying a GoPro, so what do you do? You do some research, you find a review site, somebody's taking the time, they've getting lots of specs about the GoPro, they've given you all this information, and you think, yeah, do you know what, I like the sound of this, definitely want to buy it. They'll often have a link on their website, you click through, you buy it, bang, they've just made some money. Essentially, that is all it is, an affiliate is a middleman. You send traffic from your website to another website. And being an affiliate means that you can actually do anything. You can pair credit cards, you can pair GoPros, you can pair Nikon cameras, you can pair clothes, you can literally do anything that you want to do when it comes to this. So how do you actually go about doing this and, and building a website if you know nothing about it? So I've now been a digital nomad for about four or five years. Um, I literally had no experience of coding a website. I still have no experience of coding a website. It's so easy that you don't even can't even begin to tell you how easy it is actually. So the first thing what you do is you know what product it is that you actually want to compare, for example, what kind of market it is that you want to go after. You then register your domain name and then you pay for a hosting package. And what I do is I then link that up and use WordPress. Okay? You press one button, it installs WordPress from you. From WordPress I pay then 60 US dollars and I get a theme. That then theme is drag and drop and it's a piece of cake. You then literally just then pay, say, someone on people per hour to do me a logo for $25, and there we are. I've got the basis of a website. It's very simple. WordPress is a really, really easy content marketing system to use, and I highly recommend it because it's just tons and tons of information out there for you to use on the internet for you to actually start building your own website. But remember, actually, the key to building a website is not how it looks and the design and how fancy it is. Actually, you want to get it ranking. And how are you going to get it ranking? That's by writing absolutely fantastic content. So how do you write content and get your website ranking? That this is probably the most important point about creating an affiliate website to be able to drive traffic to you. Google recognizes and rewards websites that write absolutely killer content. You need to write content that's unique, fresh, not found anywhere else, and incredibly formative and helpful. You want people to engage with your content. So let's just say, look at our GoPro here. If you want to say, you're building a website about GoPro, you could start by saying, well, look at the background of the company, talking about when it was founded, how it was founded, how the development came about, how the different series have gone up about, to then how you get to where you are now. All that content, before you know it, you're writing three, 4,000 words of unique content. The worst thing you can do is write content when you say, buy a GoPro here, buy GoPro, buy GoPro. Just be terrible, be keyword stuffing, forget about it. Just try and write content as if you're writing a piece that's educational. You'll be rewarded in the long run. Trust me, Google will love you for it. And obviously off the back of that, by, uh, that means you'll then be able to get links. So the next part you want to do is kind of like look to link build. Now we're jumping up a long way ahead of myself here because I want to keep this very brief. Okay. Now what happens is by link build, so what it is is you've got this fantastic content here all ready to go. People will then start to go, well that's really good. If I want to know all about GoPro, I might recommend saying to someone, take a visit to this website here. Before you know it, you're building authority. You're sending signals to Google to say, hey, guess what? This website here, this person really knows what they're talking about. They've written amazing content, they've got links pointing to their website, 
tell you what, let's push this up to the top of the rankings. And before you know it, it takes time, but soon you'll then start to be able to make rankings in Google. And then from there on inwards, you then should be able to start earning a passive income and be able to start building more and more different websites. So the link building thing is, that's kind of like a specialist SEO thing. You need to be very, very careful with that. Now I'm not gonna to touch on this in this uh, in this video because that's just a whole other level. That's where you really wanna do your research and be very, very careful because links are good and they'll also be really bad. You can be penalized for your website and you've spent all that time writing that great content and before you know it, it's just finished. So basically, start with the basics, write great content, and you will be rewarded by going up the rankings. But it's not just about content and linking that way. Make your site uh, interactive for people. Do some YouTube videos, great way, because then you can build engagement on your YouTube channel, you can then send traffic. Once people are on your page, they can look at that. And Google recognizes this. Media-rich websites is what it looks for. It's kind of what it rewards. Now, I don't want to tell you exactly my industry in, in how long it takes to get and how long it took me to get here because I obviously don't want many more competitors. But you need to be aware that this is the long-term game. This is not a quick fix. You do not publish a website and within two weeks you're on the first page of Google. It takes a long time. I'll give you an example. A website I published uh, is now number two in uh, Google for a keyword that I specifically targeted. It took one year to get there. It takes time, it's a slow builder. But I tell you what, once you can do one website up and running, you can then get multiple websites up and running. I'm now at the stage where uh, I'm in Sydney right now, but I'm in a UK based company. I've got content writers who I do on a subcontract basis for me, who I've taught over time. So basically if I wanted to, I could literally work just one or two hours a day if I wanted to. But I don't want to do that, I want to keep building more websites and be a bit hungry and basically just keep on traveling the world and living in places like Sydney. So, essentially, what I'm going to say is this. If you want to be a digital nomad, I could highly recommend doing going down the affiliate website route. Just be careful because there are plenty of people on Instagram who say you want to travel, look at my life, and you click a link on their website and it'll be all about signing up to their website. They're making money off the back of you. Don't make them rich, make yourself rich. Go and do this for yourself. It's hard work initially and it takes time, but in the end the rewards are really, really worth it. I would highly recommend anybody who wants to be about a digital nomad, but don't have to worry about a six month contract, being tied to one place, work anywhere, be anywhere and the best way to be that is through affiliate marketing any questions please feel free to leave them uh, in the comment section below uh, i hope you find this of help i'm also going to do a little video on the uh the good side and the bad side of being a digital nomad especially from say business and tax purposes and that kind of thing so but in the meantime thanks for watching guys keith Traveller signing out